Hi dancers, this is one of your coaches, Natalie. This is a tutorial of basic footwork you will see in Jalisco as well as throughout different regions. This is for newcomers and returners so that they can learn what the basic footwork is as well as build a vocabulary. If you have any questions about any of the steps, join us at our scheduled Zoom calls. The information about the Zoom calls will be posted on our Facebook groups. First, there's the zapateado. This consists of step, heel, step, and you repeat that consistently. As you're learning this, I would suggest to start off doing it slowly and gradually speed up. And once you start to get more comfortable with it, also practice traveling with this step so that when we start learning choreographies in the future, you'll, be, you'll feel comfortable traveling with the step. Next step is carretillas. For this step, you will start off stomping your left foot on the ground and then hitting your right heel on the ground. And then you stomp your right foot on the ground and you hit your left heel on the ground. And you just repeat that multiple times. Again, start off slowly and gradually increase speed. The last step is borrachos. For this one, you're going to be stepping side to side, so you will start off to the right and then to the left. Typically, as you do this step, you'll also be leaning your torso. For paso cruzado, you start stepping with your left, scraping your right heel across, then stepping with your left again and scraping your right heel back. Then you're going to step with the right foot, scrape your left heel across, step, and scrape your left heel back. Paso cruzado with remate is the same as just paso cruzado, only that in between you're doing two remates before you start the next paso cruzado. When you're doing your turns, with spotting, you're trying to make your face the last thing the audience sees and the first thing they see again. So you keep your face facing forward while you rotate your body and then rotate your head back around quickly so that you face forward again. Spotting is going to help minimize how dizzy you get, but it's also going to help you have cleaner turns. These turns are used in a variety of regions, but you're going to see a lot of them in Jalisco songs. As you're spinning, your arms are going to try to draw a disc as you're spinning. So they're taking turns which one is going to travel up and then down. Make sure that you're spotting while you're doing these turns as well.